Hey guys, James Wolf here, and today is another episode of Stardew Valley. Um, yeah. Um, I have installed a... I've got to make the week, the monthly pilgrimage, or the seasonally pilgrimage to the store. And actually, I'm going to rearrange the... So... Uh, weird story, um, I'm someone that you'll find quite regularly browsing different uh, automotive selling websites, like AutoTrader, AutoTrader.ca, Auto, or Canadian AutoTrader, um, both American, or, er, American, German, British, or, er, British, and Canadian, car guru and shit like that I searched all over and quite recently I started searching Japanese and I found one called pan cart Japanese uh, Japanese car trader or something like that There's the Japanese version of auto trader but they also import the cars to America and it's like um, and I found an typical at least, if you're gonna if you're gonna go Japan uh, Japanese in car uh, cars, you gotta look at the GTR. But um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank you. There for your ball. But um, yeah, I found an R35, the newest one, a 2010, I believe, for like thirty thousand dollars US. Don't know if that's decent compared to what normal uh, R35s are, but I mean, I've looked in America and they're at least 40. So, 10 grand off, well, I think you're going to spend that in shipping, but you get a right hand drive Japanese R35. Hell yeah, I'd go for that. Hell, if I ever happen to make it to a million subs, I'll buy myself a Japanese R35, and I will happily drive it around. And you can hold me to that, I'll actually put that in my phone, as, as one of the few things I said I would- <sighs> Wait a minute, where are my trees? Where are my trees? All my trees are gone. Fuck you. But, yeah. And I'll put that in my phone, and that'll be something I said I'll do in a million subs. But, yeah. I'll probably never get to a million subs. So, yeah. Or at least I won't get to it anytime soon, so it's not like something I have to worry about next week. I would really, really. The, re the reason I would go for a right, uh, I would go for a Japanese R35, because it's right-hand drive. Most most YouTubers that hit a million subs or whatever, billion views or whatever, they always go down to their local Nissan dealer and they always pick up a left-hand drive uh, GTR, just American. I'd go down to my local Nissan dealer and hey, and go, hey, can you import something for me? I want a right-hand drive uh, GTR. I don't want to. I don't want a Nismo because fuck Nismo. I just want a pl uh, premium edition or premium level uh, GTR in either red, black, or silver. That's all I want. And I'm pretty sure, and 
a Nissan dealer would be able to get me one. Given enough time. It, it's going to take a month or so for it to get to the port of New York and go through quarantine and all that. Because I'm li I live in Philly. So it would come th it would come through New York. I don't, because Philadelphia doesn't have a... Or the state of Pennsylvania doesn't have a port, port to it. But yeah, I would, I would do that. Because I find them ridiculously cool. I would also have uh, the Nissan dealer convert everything over to like, not uh, like, I would have them put a uh, mile per hour uh, cluster, or um, Imperial, that's it. I'd have them put an Imperial gauge cluster in and I'd have them change all the language over to English so I could actually use the car, but it would still be right hand drive. And most, most of you people would probably be like, why not just buy a left-hand drive car and convert it over to right-hand drive? Because you'd have to replace the entire dash. Um, you'd have to replace the entire dash, steering rack, and all that. And it's like, just import the car, wait a little longer, and all you got to change is language and a dash cluster. And that's all. Yeah. Damn, it's 3 o'clock in the afternoon already. Uh, pumpkin. Uh, 13 days to mature. I want something that takes 14 days to mature and continues to produce afterwards. 20. And you to provide afterwards. Holy shit! I had over 3 grand! I bought 40 seeds. I honestly didn't pay attention to the price, though. So that's where that went. But, yeah. I'm going to try and... 5, 14. So I'm going to have two batches of these. Before I have one batch of this. I'm going to make one of these. Okay, I have the hoe in hand. Okay. But yeah. I, I... I would also have to look into, like, how much it would cost to insure a Japanese R35 and all this, but... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Why the fuck can I? You're running into the side of the house, dog. It's six, uh, seven o'clock. Jesus. Uh, and then, watering can.
tomato. Eat the spice berry. Eat another spice berry. Eat another spice berry. Eat a third spice. Eat a fourth spice berry. It's eight thirty at night, and I'm outside watering plants. Go to sleep. I should make my money back with these, so, I mean, it's not that big of a fucking deal. Well, if I didn't continue to aim for the long fucking tile, I'd be able to. There we go. I'm happy. What else am I going to do? I'm going to search the property, see if there's anything else that needs taken out. Seriously, no trees. No trees whatsoever. Wow. I guess that happens with the season change. Before I had trees covering most of my fucking property, and now that I've taken them all out and need them, because I, I never thought of that, but now that I need them, there's none to be fucking found. That's pissing me off. Hi, babe. I'm pissed at my dog. IRL. Because I have uh, glasses. I wear glasses. Quite strong prescriptions, actually. And um, the cleaning cloth that came with my glasses. Oops, sorry. She decided today that taking it off my dresser that I have and using it as a chew toy would be a fabulous idea. So she tore it to shreds. And it's pissing me off. Because I only have two. Thankfully, I have the extra one. But, yeah. I believe this is the corn. This may be, This is the eggplant. Uh, yeah. There you go. Ooh, ooh, this gives me an opportunity to show you a new mod I installed. Uh, I'd like to give my cows a special treat. They're such good girls and hungry too. Could you bring me one bunch of amaranth? I do not have it, unfortunately. But yeah, it's better rain. Um, it's been made a more blue, I guess. And the puddles have been dated too. But since I don't have to do anything today, I'll fill her bowl. But I don't think she's coming out of the house. Oh, 34. 
I think I'm gonna leave this up here. <laughs> Good doggo. Good doggo. Cream sauce. Cream sauce here. Radish salad. You've learned how to radish salad. Weather report. Looks like a storm is approaching. Thunder and lightning expected. Alright, All right, well, I think I'm going to leave this episode up here. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to comment, subscribe, and as always, I should catch you guys in the next video. Have a great, wonderful day. Bye-bye. Mm,